London, West Ham's Manuel Lanzini has been charged over diving to win a penalty against Stoke City, the second Premier League player to be targeted under new rules aimed at stamping out cheating. The 24-year-old Argentine went down when challenged by Eric Peters and West Ham captain Mark Noble converted from the spot to give the visitors a 1-0 lead on Saturday. The decision infuriated Stoke manager Mark Hughes, who is under intense more pressure following the 3-0 home defeat, which leaves his side a single point above the Premier League relegation spots. Lanzini has until 18 o'clock GMT on Tuesday to respond to the charge, which is officially known as the successful deception of a match official, in this case referee Graham Scott. Introduced this season, a simulation charge only comes when there is clear evidence a player has fooled an official into winning a penalty or getting an opponent sent off, either via a straight red card or second yellow. Decisions are made, on a fast track basis, by a panel comprising one ex-official, one ex-manager and one ex-player. All three review the video footage independently and a charge follows only when they are unanimous. If the charge is accepted or upheld by an independent commission, the guilty player receives a two-match ban and any cards involved are rescinded. Last month, Everton striker Umar Nice was banned for diving to win a penalty in his side's 2-2 draw with Crystal Palace. In Monday's Daily Mail newspaper, ex-referee Graham Pohl wrote that he thought Lanzini would avoid a charge, describing it as a bit of a dive but not an outrageous one. Speaking to reporters after Saturday's game, Hughes said, I've seen it again. The guy's dived he's drawn the challenge. He's a clever player. It sounds like sour grapes when you talk about people getting punished retrospectively. It doesn't help us now, he added.